Mississippi Highway Patrol troopers were out early this morning providing extra protection as school buses were picking up children. The bus detail follows last week's tragic death of a nine-year-old Lee County child who was hit while boarding his school bus. WCBI's Allie Martin was with the MHP bus detail in Pontotoc County and has this report. For this route, bus 97 had a guest passenger. Corporal Brad Hogue is with Troop F of the Mississippi Highway Patrol. He's making sure motorists stop as the bus picks up its precious cargo. The same road you went down. Captain Chad Moore follows in an unmarked unit as part of the school bus detail. This bus this morning was one of the ones we have a, a tremendous problem with because it is on the four lane US 278 and uh, people are driving a little faster. Bus driver Marsha Russell is also a teacher at the North Pontotoc Attendance Center, she makes sure to take every safety precaution, including extending the safety arm, the stop sign, and switching on those flashing lights. Still, she says some drivers disregard it all. Sometimes people just keep on going. Some of the uh, drivers are almost like NASCAR. They're just trying to weave in and out, trying to get a, just a little bit ahead. All the motorists on the bus route we were following with MHP did what they were supposed to do. They obeyed the law. Of course, the tragic events of last week are still on the minds of everyone, but bus drivers and highway patrol know that motorists have short memories and attention spans. If something like this happens, it's on the news, and it seems that we don't have as big a problem with it for a while, but you know, it doesn't take them long to start getting back into those bad habits again. Captain Moore says drivers distracted by their cell phones is the biggest problem. And when troopers aren't on the buses, drivers get help from students like Julian King, who get tag numbers of motorists who make an illegal pass. That's why it's important for people to stop when the bus is stopped. So they won't hit any children? In Pontotoc County, Allie Martin, WCBI News. And MHP Troop F also conducted school bus details in Tippa and Alcorn counties.